Hello and welcome to the Reboot Speedrun tutorial. This video is on the advanced route for level 2. The advanced route ends up looking a lot like the beginner route, except we're going to be doing the early tear glitch. So as normal, start by getting rid of those boxes and carry through to grab the blaster. You don't necessarily need to worry about getting rid of these turrets as you grab the blaster. We are going to need to take damage for the death abuse anyway. I do recommend taking out this blaster, or this turret, uh, as you climb these boxes. If you don't, it can get a number of shots in on you as you go up for that life. If you still have a lot of health by the time you get down here, it can be worth hanging out by those turrets to take some extra damage. Maybe even take some damage as you mend the tear. The tear was mended at about 53 seconds. As normal, we want to wait about 10 or 12 seconds before dying. You have a little bit of leeway for the death on this level, but you don't want to wait too long before dying. You do want uh, to probably grab the other extra life as well. You can grab it without losing time here. Ooh, if you can make that jump, that's a nice one. That saves a little bit of time. If not, just take the normal path up to, uh, to the key. This room is very laggy, so it slows down a lot. Be careful about that. But even if you do get a lot of slowdown, uh, the game slowing down does not affect the tear spawn timers. So, uh... You can still get out of there without losing time. We haven't killed these binomes yet, so they will try to swing in here. Ideally, kill them in such a way that they don't block the door. Uh, the third tear will be running by the time we get to it, so any time we spend bumping on those binomes, leaving that room is just time lost. Swing over here, mend the tear, try your best to turn around before the vid window cutscene plays to jump up here easily. Break these boxes as you go through. When you jump down to the vid window, if you jump a little early, if you actually like release your jump instead of dropping down, you'll notice Bob bonks his head. You can bonk your head and fall just that little bit faster into the vid window. If you have any further questions or comments, please leave them uh, below or feel free to ask in the Discord.